Hello there everyone, welcome to a new video. It is me Desiree and we are here with something fun today. This is gonna be Would You Rather Beauty Edition. If you don't know what Would You Rather is, it's basically where you choose between two things. One, they're either two bad things or two good things. Um, and as I read the questions, you'll kind of get the gist of what it is. I'm sure everyone knows what, what Would You Rather is. Um, I didn't Google to see if anyone else has done this. I'm pretty sure this has been done millions of times by now. Nothing's original anymore, but that's okay. It's original to my channel and I thought it would be really fun. So I have 10 questions here. I'll leave them all down in the description box. If you want to do this video, you want to leave your um, uh, answers down in the comment section, I would love to hear. I would love to watch your video and read your comment. Awesome. Okay, let's get started. First thing is, would you rather have long luscious lashes or full eyebrows? I would rather have full eyebrows, like no question. I have pretty decent lashes already, but if I had to get rid of those to have like beautiful, filled in, nice, natural brows, I would give my right arm. I wouldn't, I wouldn't give my right arm for them. But I would pay a lot of money to have natural full eyebrows. I wish I did so badly, but they're so thin and they're so light and I plucked the heck out of them when I was growing up and they never grew back. Some people are lucky and they, they grow back, mine do not. If you've seen me do me makeup on camera, you've seen my 10 eyebrow hairs that I have. Um, oh, I would love to have full eyebrows, I would love it. Uh, the next question is, would you rather have no eyelashes or no eyebrows? Um, I would rather have no eyebrows. I just said I would give my right arm to have full eyebrows, but if I had to pick between no eyelashes and no eyebrows, I would say no eyebrows. I pretty much, they're 90% filled in every day as it is. Um, so I have no problem just drawing them on every day. Uh, the next one is, would you rather have oily skin or dry skin for the rest of your life? Hey, please, I'm trying to do something. Um, I would rather have oily skin. I went back and forth on this one because I was like, oh no, dry skin, but I feel like it would feel tight all the time or flaky. Um, I would say oily skin. Right now my skin's pretty normal, like in the middle. I don't really have too dry, too oily. Um, I would say oily. I think I could deal with oily a lot better than dry. Um, the next one is, would you rather use only cream eyeshadows for the rest of your life or powder shadows for the rest of your life? Uh, this, this question actually, I found my answer interesting because I picked cream. I'd rather use cream eyeshadows for the rest of my life. I don't know why, but right now I'm like really into cream eyeshadows. I got this two pack of these Julep um, cream eyeshadow 101 sticks at uh, Costco. And then I also, and then I loved this one so much called Champagne Shimmer. Whoops, wrong side. Just looks like this. I've been loving this one so much. It glides on so easy. And then I had this little mini from Bobbi Brown that I really love. I have a Laura Mercier one that's really awesome. And I had been, um, no, I haven't been home for a couple days, so I had been using the cream eyeshadow in the morning really quickly. It looked awesome, blended quickly, it didn't fade, didn't crease. I loved it so much, so right now, I would say cream eyeshadow, as long as it's a good one. Um, there are some really dry ones, or dry stick, you know, they pull on your eyelid skin. Um, right now, I would say cream, it just seems easier right now. Uh, the next question, would you rather take showers every day or baths every day? Like, only showers, only baths. I would, I went back and forth on this one too, but then I don't want to be like in a hurry and have to fill up the whole bath and you know, um, I, showers, showers, okay, showers all the way. Um, would you rather have your hair professionally done every day or your makeup professionally done every day? Like every single day you have to go get your hair professionally done or your nails professional, not your hairs, your hair or your makeup professionally done every day. I would go for hair. I don't know how to do anything with my hair. I mean, you see it like this all the time. It's a little poof up here, pulled back into a ponytail, into a bun. Right now it's in a bun for work. Um, or I wear it down and just let it air dry naturally. I wish I was good at hair. I watch people's tutorials. I see people on Instagram. I see the Pinterest. I don't know how to do hair. I, I don't know how to do my hair. I don't know how to manage it or anything like that. So I would pay to have my hair done every single day if I had to. Makeup, I think, is fun to do yourself. Um, I don't do it professionally, like, enough to not get it done. I would love to get it done one day. But I feel like if someone did my makeup professionally, it wouldn't look like me. Like, I, I wouldn't feel like I look like myself. Because, you know, they don't know your preferences and your likes. They do it how they think your face would look the best. Anyway, 
I would love to get my hair professionally done every day. I would love it. Um, would you rather have acrylics all the time or never be able to do your nails ever? Like not even out at home manicure. Ugh. I, I, I've never had acrylic nails. I had them one time in middle school. I don't know if I got, if they, we did them at home or something. I don't know. Um, but I, acrylic nails are just not me. Like they just don't feel like they, they just, they're not me. Uh, but not wearing nail polish ever. Can the acrylics be like really, really short and look like my, my nails? But even then it's like tall, like they're thick. Oh, I want to, I want to say what I learned to love acrylic nails. Uh, I want to say, I'll say no nail polish. No, uh, I don't know. I don't know about that one. We'll go no nail polish, no nail polish. Uh, I don't know. I'm confused on that one. Um, okay. Would you rather wear lipstick only or lip gloss only? Like if you could only pick one lip gloss or lipsticks, I pick lip gloss all the way. I'm not a lipstick person. I don't really love a lot of color on my lips. Uh, a lot of lip glosses I have are clear. This is one that I love right now. Uh, the Kosas wet oil lip gloss. I love this. I also love the, um, Fenty gloss bombs. Those are awesome as well. Uh, lipstick. I wish I loved lipstick. It just, it's also not me. I just don't, my mouth, I, I don't, I just don't want color on my lips. It just, it's not really me. Seems too grown up. I don't know what. It seems like a grown up swear lipstick and I'm just not there yet. I don't know. Um, and then the last one, oh no, I have two questions left. Uh, next one is, would you rather wear only concealer the rest of your life or foundation the rest of your life? Um, like if you picked foundation, you can never wear concealer again. Um, and then vice versa. I would go concealer. There are most days I do wear just, like today I'm just wearing the um, Neutrogena. I freaking love this concealer. The Radiant Cream Concealer. I love it. I wear this as foundation all, not found, I don't put it all over like foundation, but I wear it as like my only base all the time. I love it. But I also love foundations that kind of double up as concealer. Like you don't like, uh, no, I'm going to go concealer. I do it all the time. I go concealer all the way. Um, and then the last question is, would you rather use dirty sponges for the rest of your life or dirty brushes for the rest of your life? I am going to say brushes. I'd rather use dirty brushes for the rest of my life. I think brushes work better with a little grit on them and a little like product. New brushes, especially eye brushes, don't work the same as ones that are used a little bit. Even if you rub off the color on something like this, like a little, what do they call these things? I don't know. It brush cleaner. It has a name, like a, like a brand name. I can't think of it now, but it's like this little sponge in here. You kind of like rub your, your brushes on to get powder products off. So you can use another color without, it's an easy way to clean your brushes. What am I trying to say? Um, so even if you use that, it, it takes the product off, but it doesn't make it feel like it's freshly washed. I, I love my brushes with a little wear on them. I don't know. I'd rather use dirty brushes the rest of my life. Cause I kind of do now anyway. Okay. That is it. My friends, those are the 10 questions for the, would you rather video? Uh, if you want to answer these questions, I would love to read your answers. I will leave the questions down below in the comment section. If you want to add to this and add in your own little you know, extra questions, bonus questions. I would love to answer them. I would love to know your would you rather's beauty edition. Anyway, that is it. Thanks for watching this video and I will see you later uh, with another one. Bye.